Be proud of who you are. Be very, very much proud of who you are. You took your power back and went through a transformation. You are now on fire. You are now on fire. You are now on fire. And things are happening in your life now that they were meant to happen because there was a delay. Hallelujah. It's your time to move forward in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. You've gone through a moment of transformation, beloved, and now you are unstoppable. You struggled. Really, indeed. You felt as though your power was gone. As though your dignity was gone, as though your confidence was bruised, as though it, it felt it felt really like you were it's like you were in a dark place where you just could not see yourself. You could not you could not see a way out of a situation or a way out of something because you were so engulfed by those things and you were being it's like in your spirit, your soul, your mind, there was a torment that was going on. There was a torment in your flesh that prevented you from moving forward from seeing things differently, from waking up, from taking actions. You could not take action, you could not think, you could not do just so, just so much that you were thinking about. Beloved, the Lord is saying this moment to you that, it's, that you are now back on fire. You have regained, you have recovered yourself, you have recovered your strength. And right now, you, it's time for you to take action. The moment of action is here. You are back in alignment with God's will for your life. You are, back, you are back in alignment with God's word for your life. In Jesus' mighty name. You are back in alignment with, with just everything that you've been thinking about. Those things that the enemy stood on the way to prevent you from achieving, it's time for you to achieve those things. You are back in alignment with, the, with God's will for your life. Hallelujah. Hosea 6 verse 1. Come, let us return to the Lord. He has turned us to pieces, but he will heal us. He has injured us, but he will bind us, up our, bind up our wounds. Glory to God. God allowed you to go through those situations. But you are back. He allowed you to be injured, but he's here to heal your wounds. God has, in fact, he has really healed your wounds. Also, you are still going through healing. A lot of you are still going through healing. Hallelujah. And some of you have really received your healing. And some of you are still about to get enter into your healing process. Glory be to God. God is, is restoring you once again. You, because you are back in alignment with him. All those things that you, you did that were contrary to his will for your life actually backfired. Some of them actually, you know, some mistake that you made actually like went against you. You've healed those things. You've healed those things. You've healed in whatever way. Could it be that you had relationship issues, or financial issues, those things? Those were the things that you needed to heal to come into this space right now to start a new chapter in your life and be more grounded, be more faithful and be more at peace and be more loving and be more successful in all areas of your life. This is your time, beloved. Hallelujah. God has brought you this far. It's a new moment, a time to be on fire, a time to be to take action, a time to... To run without being without going weary. It's it's time to not doubt yourself. It is time that you are once again back in your power to do those things that you have ever been prevented from doing in time past. Glory to God. It's your time to manifest. Just exactly what you've been dreaming and hoping for in time past. Glory be to God. I love you so much, but Christ loves you even more. Faith is our vehicle, love is our strength. See you in the next. In the next. Hallelujah.